So I'm Stephanie Flanders, I'm head of Bloomberg Economics. We're thinking about platforms, machine learning and privacy. Everyone knows that they want regulation, but not what regulation. The questions that we're raising, the, the concept that we're developing allows us to think about where we can start and what might be the principles that guide any policy. Even the large platforms, they have an intuitive feeling that more data is better for them. Where should we um, start investigating where monopoly power, where market power may arise? Some in the private sector said things like GDPR are actually stifling our private sector innovation. It's not necessarily the case that, that all privacy regulation needs to be innovation stifling. On, on the one hand, um, regulation that makes consumers confident um, and that, that allows innovators to, to you know, act with in, within a, a sort of transparent set of regulations, um, I think can be super effective, actually. But even just what the information is, is not necessarily a given. I mean, it's certainly not transparent in the case of Facebook. What they are doing with the information is profoundly opaque. That's right. So I think that we will have to create new institutions. We will have to create uh, new agencies in order to, to, to harness really the benefits of the information and um, to suppress uh, some of the harm that might arise. It's worth saying that, that access to data is crucial in AI innovation. But there will be a race towards some sort of standard setting in protecting privacy, in protecting civil liberties. Dirk Bergman and Noam Juchtman, thank you. Thank you very much. And thanks to everyone uh, for listening.